we have three courses. We have a HCA qualification, uh, which is nine months. We have a foundation degree that lets students register as hearing aid audiologists or hearing aid dispensers over two years. And we have a one year bachelor's top up, which at the moment just turns the foundation degree into a bachelor's degree. But in the future, we're hoping to seek RCCP accreditation. Our offerings let students join at a variety of points and exit at a variety of points as well. So we have a nine month hearing care assistant course, which will let somebody do clinical work very quickly. We have the foundation degree that lets students register as, as the protected title of hearing aid dispenser. And for those wanting to go further, we have the bachelor's top-up course where we explore more complex aspects of audiology and we are hoping to have that course accredited to let students register as audiologists as well. We're based in Cambridge and students come to us for about one week out of four during term time. So for the most part they're in your clinic, getting more and more proficient, doing things more independently under supervision and they come to us for lectures, for practicals and for exams as well. Part of my background was training as a clinical scientist and I did that at Addenbrooke's Hospital in Cambridge and I studied for a master's degree at the same time. This is really, really similar to the kind of things that we get students to do on our course. You're working in a clinical environment most of the time, but you've also got academic work to get done as well. So I really empathise from that point of view. I've been there, I've done it, and it's something which I bring to my teaching as well. We want to make it as easy as possible for the student to manage that work-life balance, but at the same time, get the work done to a really high standard as well. It gives me a real feeling of pride to see a student go from first being introduced to a topic to becoming really competent at it and being able to do it themselves in clinic.